the good confidence that you can talk to people if you haven't really like got the ability to in person but yeah. then there's a the false confidence and the confidence of saying something nasty that you never say in person i've had comments telling me that they want to kill me or something and i'm like yeah. you wouldn't murder me in real life <laughs> Social media obviously is massive in our lives, isn't it? And in mm. everyone's life. I mean, <sighs> we do our work on it, but yeah. everyone is addicted, man. They are. I do oh agree. God, I, I'm having a really bad time with social media, mm. I'm not going to lie. Like, the past couple of months, I felt really depressed. It's making us feel physically ill. It's because you compare your life to, yeah. to other people's mm. lives. You see people going on these amazing holidays, yeah. wearing designer clothes, with amazing and bodies. Like yeah. the other day, I just signed out. I was like, literally log out. Mm. Like because I was literally getting obsessed. Like I'm obsessing over so many things. Like I'm like, at least this. you signed out though. Yeah. yeah. Like, like you I, did I mean, that. I signed back in. <laughs> Seven hours later because <laughs> yeah, but I'm still, yeah, I am addicted. I know. I feel like if I didn't earn most of my money on social media, I wouldn't really use it. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Just because like it's it, it does make you depressed sometimes. Like your your your, your life is Instagram. How do you know many I mean? you want it a day? Like how often do you? use Oh my it? god! You have one of them things now, don't you? On I tell you, I, I literally swipe off then. it. Like I don't want to see. I don't so want to see I've how got, addicted I am. One day, thirteen hours. <sighs> It was a bad one. I was like, this isn't well. I was going to say six hours. Mine was six yeah. hours and I was offended. Don't mean. <laughs> that's, that's not well. That's so really fast. bad. No wonder why you have to log out. Jesus. That is not well. I think that I am addicted though because apparently they say the first thing you, you have to do in the morning is your addiction. And I pick up my phone. You should get up in the morning. You should not make touch your phone. You that's should make your gone. bed. Yeah, you should do something else. But we don't. I don't. So but bad. I love it. I love it because, you know, it's part of my job. Yeah. I get to, we have so many, well, let's talk about the trolls, but you have so many nice people. Agreed, yeah. There's so many lovely people on social media. Yeah. And like, and there's fan pages and everyone's like, like shouting about each other and like, you go yeah, girl, you're like, fit, you look beautiful. Yeah. Like, I love that part mm. of it. I feel like there's a lot of girls supporting girls in there as well. Yeah. Like, especially like with what we do, I feel like everyone just comes together and shows mm. love on posts. And yeah. the bad side is obviously the trolls and the addiction and the depression and the good side is, the money we obviously make and mm. like meeting new people. You can have these pages where, you know, you've got Instagram TV now, yeah. where you can sit there and talk about your life and talk about how you feel and yeah. like cause more awareness, you know, to mental health and things yeah. like that. Yeah. So at the same time, you can help people. I feel like we need to start using it in moderation. Same. Yeah. But it's hard when it's your job. And as well, like sometimes if you put a photo up and you don't get many likes, like how awful does that make you feel? Yeah, it makes that's you- stupid, isn't it? Yeah, it's so like, bad. All because of that double tap. If sometimes I put a photo up and I'm like, God, I thought that was really good. I thought it looked really pretty. Why aren't people double and tapping that that photo? And oh. Why is that girl getting more likes than me? And I'm like, what the hell is wrong? <laughs> it is horrible. You're 29 years of age, and you're worried about a like I on know, Instagram. I know. That's not well. But Instagram's it making it a lot harder these days for you to be getting likes. I think. Don't you ever think like, oh, I'm not getting likes because I'm ugly or no one likes me. It's just probably most of the people aren't seeing your post yeah. because of the way it's set out now. Yeah. It's really hard, and there's a lot of competition out there. Like. Everyone is on Instagram, everyone's a blogger. Walk down the street or you go to your local supermarket, whatever, do you see these girls? Or do you see no, all these No, I people? don't know where they, they are. Don't. Where are they from? Where are they? I, I think... just post their best parts as well. Most people do, yeah. do We're living in a cyber world. That's yeah. what it is. Is it, do you think it's changing the way we sort of interact with each other? Oh, 100%. In real life. <laughs> so you go for dinner with your pals, You'll all be in there Snapchatting and putting up what you're doing and, and what the food's coming. The first time sitting. my food comes, I'm like this. I, take, I don't even eat, I don't even take a bite, I'm snapping it. Same, yeah, it's I don't cold. Do that. That's crazy. The food's I, eat, cold. I eat the food, I eat the food, I'm sorry, I'm not one of them foodies. I'm like, get it in my mouth. Oh, <laughs> That's the one God. thing I don't do. It's crazy. But it is true, you do sit there on your phone yeah. and then we video it. We take all these memories and then we say, oh yeah, no, I'm doing it because I want it as a memory. I never look yeah. at that photo again. Mm. I'm lying to myself. Like, yeah. But I think the one good thing about Instagram, like, if you do have the confidence to do so, is sometimes put my not so best bits yeah. on. Because I feel yeah, like I it's, it's important to like mm. let these your followers know that you're just a normal person. Mm. Like you you aren't just living this high life. Like you have insecurities, you have anxiety, you have depression. Anxiety. And that's the good thing about yeah. social media because we can combat the whole thought that there's this perfection to life. Yeah. Mm. Like this can't. morning I posted I had spots all over my face. <laughs> and I'm sitting here now with a full face of makeup. Yeah. But I've let girls know that, you know, everyone wakes mm. up with spots. People meet people through social media as yeah. well. I found my boyfriend through Instagram because yeah. I slid into the DM. You've I would Instagram. rather meet someone in person though. Like if you're not confident enough to go up to that person in real life, now social media you have the ability to be like, oh, I actually want to talk to you, but I'm a bit scared. Yeah, exactly. Yeah.
but you have to be careful. Obviously, that's again the negative side, where it's like catfishing and shit. Oh, yeah. yeah. There's obviously confidence, like the good confidence that you can talk to people if you haven't really like got the ability to in person. But yeah. then there's a the false confidence and the confidence of saying something nasty. You never say in person. Mm. Like I've had comments telling me that they want to kill me or something, and I'm like, yeah. you wouldn't murder me in real life. Exactly. Mm. Like then people down the street would not strap me and go, oh, by the way, live. I don't like your hair. Yeah, your legs mm. look fat. I would never say yeah. that. No. But then why does it give them a right to do it behind a screen? Like It's just disgusting. It's weird. Like, I don't know how they get away with it. Like, like there should be, like, some sort of law or something because it's... it's it's actually damaging Katie to people. Katie Price, because of Harvey, she's actually done oh, something he gets now a lot of where yeah. it's like, yeah. it's going to court. And thank God for that, because yeah. it should be illegal. Yeah. It should be a criminal offence for people to, to be saying things like that. The law just hasn't caught up with yeah. where we they're are. They're not up to date. Yeah, they're not up to date. And yeah. no one wants to become up to date because it's really scary. Like yeah. having to what? Have a law so you can't say what you want to say. Yeah. Yeah. There's a borderline between an opinion and actually bullying someone. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I don't know, like, oh, I'm I not, not fussing that dress, dress yeah. or something. But when you're calling people fat or... Saying them to kill themselves. Yeah, or, yeah. then that's that's just crazy. Yeah. As long as you treat it like with respect, you have to respect social media for the frigging power that it has. Mm. Yeah. It's a beast. <laughs>